What is going on guys, it is Halftime Productions, welcome back to the channel, first of all I hope you're all having a great day, and fellas, Madden 24 is finally here, and so in honor of it coming out, I decided to put every single team in the game into one giant 32 team tournament, and this is going to be crazy as we're doing a live game simulation on the new Madden, Madden 24 with all the teams, and as you see this is their bracket, I actually randomized the teams and the orders, however this is the AFC with all the AFC teams, Teams, and this is the NFC with all the NFC teams so you can look at the bracket study it right now guys and comment down below your final four predictions I want to see them in the comments right now who do you guys have in the final four today simulation but man oh man I'm so excited for football so excited for Madden I just love the NFL season there's gonna be more Madden simulations but this is the first one I can't wait to see what the game looks like how it's gonna play out and more importantly who is gonna win this giant 2024 NFL simulation and as as you all know I'm from Pittsburgh so I got my Steelers jersey on Kenny Pickett and man another comment I want you guys to add is what is your favorite NFL team I want to see them down below however guys this is your last chance to look at the bracket we're gonna begin here in the round of 32 go to the Sweet 16 Elite 8 and then the final four of course so sit down sit back relax go grab your favorite snack as the road to the Super Bowl will begin here in the very first round without further ado fellas let's get this simulation underway here we go Fellas, here we go. We start off this 32 team tournament where the Patriots are down by five to the Cincinnati Bengals. 41 seconds from their own 28. The Patriots need a touchdown to win this game. And for the Bengals, all they need to do is to get a stop. And they are on to the Sweet 16 as now 36 seconds. Only two timeouts for the Patriots. Second and one from their own 37. Mac Jones finds his man. Can he get out of bounds? Yes, he does. Kendrick Bourne with a big time play, gets out of bounds, stops the clock, 30 seconds remaining, and the Patriots, I mean, can they get into the end zone, that's what it's all about, they can't afford a field goal as Mac Jones, new fresh set of downs, throws left side, out of bounds and incomplete, not the greatest of passes there, and what do you guys think about the graphics here in Madden, does it look the same or does it look different, as Jones, second and 10 going deep, and it's almost intercepted, but incomplete. What a great defensive play. So now a third and 10, 20 seconds. Patriots fans on their feet. Jones in the pocket, has all day, throws left side, out of bounds. And that's going to bring up a fourth down, and the game is on the line. Patriots need to convert. Bengals looking to move on to win the game right here. Pressure is on for Mac Jones and the Patriots. Here we go. Snaps the ball. Jones looking. Ball tipped. And it's caught. Unbelievable. One of the craziest plays you'll ever see. The ball was tipped and then caught by Juju Smith Schuster. And that keeps the game alive for the Patriots as they burn a timeout. Unbelievable, I can't believe that just happened. And if the Bengals lose this game, it is going to be a heartbreak as now only four seconds to second and nine. This could be the last play of the game. Jones to the end zone, and it's caught. Touchdown, Patriots, as time expires. Are you kidding me? This is how we're starting off the tournament. This is how we're starting off Madden. Born to the end zone. They actually have one second remaining, but basically that's going to be over. I mean, talk about miracles. Mac Jones, the Patriots, are going to win this game on the last second after they get a tip pass to Juju. Bengals fans, I mean, this is heartbreak. I can't believe it as the Patriots stun Cincinnati in the first round. And now we are moving on to Kansas City where the Chiefs will knock off the Browns. A close game nonetheless, but the Chiefs will pull away, winning 28-21. to So the former Super Bowl champs are now moving on to the Sweet 16. As now it's the Las Vegas Raiders who will fall 17-38 against the Jaguars so Jacksonville gets the job done a blowout and the Raiders with Jimmy Garoppolo will be going home in the very first round as Trevor Lawrence and this Jack squad looking to go to the final four as they are one step closer as we now got a game in Washington Commanders Saints going out at 40 seconds Commanders down by two all they need is a field goal to win and look at how escaped the pocket on the move down to about the 39, third and three, 34 seconds, and the commander is still not on field goal range yet, as the Saints are looking for a stop to win it, and look at the QB scramble again, this time he's got some room, down to the 40, maybe in field goal range, this will be about a 57 yarder from here, but first and 10, clock is ticking, they have a timeout, I'm not sure what the commanders are doing right now, 
They're gonna burn the timeout. 11 seconds now. Saints just sitting, they can't believe this. Neither can I, Commanders. What are they doing? They're not gonna go for the field goal. Time's gonna run out to the end zone. Incomplete. Madden just cost the Commanders a win as the Saints are lucky in this one. And New Orleans will advance in a crazy finish. I am actually stunned. Saints are moving on. And now we are going to go to Detroit where the Giants will knock off the Lions 27-10. And I'm not going to lie, I thought the Lions were going to win this game. However, the Giants get it done and they are on their way to Sweet 16. But man, what a crazy first round it's been already. So much fun. As now we have our first shutout of the simulation. It is the Cowboys 24-0 against the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. And the Cowboys are moving on. So no Tom Brady, but Baker Mayfield leads his squad to a first-round exit. 24-0. Dallas is headed on this week 16 in this Madden 24 simulation. Anyways, we are now on a Pittsburgh. It's a snowy game as the Chargers are down by four. On the move under a minute, they get the first down. And the Chargers are looking to win this game. Steelers defense needs to step up and get a stop as Palmer gets the first down conversion now another first down here's herbert in the pocket pressure comes finds his man but only a few yards there actually i don't even think he was in bounds so a second and ten for justin herbert and the chargers here's kenny pickett on the sideline hoping his defense can get a stop in to win this game 47 seconds herbert looking and he feels the pressure as he's sacked by hayward one of the league's best defensive ends he gets it done and now a third and 16 this could be the game for the chargers need a big play 25 seconds one time out herbert in the pocket going right taking off no he's gonna throw it caught by keenan allen and he's in for the touchdown, Chargers strike in Pittsburgh, and they take the lead. What a play by Herbert, getting out of the pocket, finding his receiver, and the Chargers get a touchdown late here in Pittsburgh, and what kind of tackling was that? Anyways, the game is on the line for Pittsburgh, 14 seconds, need to get in a field goal range to set it to overtime. Here we go, 31-28, as here's Pickett first down, going deep and has a man, it's Pickett, gets in the field goal range, and the Steelers, what a play, this game isn't over just yet, Chargers fans can't believe it, oh my goodness, how about Kenny Pickett in the pocket, finding his go-to guy as Pickens burns his man and it gets all the way down in a snowy game that might have something to do with it but this field goal needs to be good by Boswell for overtime it's up and it's good this game is going to overtime Chris Boswell ties it up here late as now in overtime the Steelers will end up getting the ball first but it's a third down they need to convert to keep the drive alive Pickens goes down, and it's sacked by Joey Bosa. Bosa, one of the league's best edge rushers, gets him down, and the Steelers are going to have to give the ball to the Chargers. And LA has had the 39-yard line. Usually they can take a field goal from here, but it's snowy, so they can't. Looking to get more yards. Herbert throws across his body, and it's intercepted. Picked off by the Steelers, and they're going to get it back. A costly turnover and mistake from Herbert. As the Steelers now have it at midfield, a third and inches. Hands off to Narshi Harris, has some room, out of bounds, and he's in field goal range. 32 yard line, a big time run from Narshi on third down. And the Steelers are moving here in this overtime game, where all they need is a field goal to win it. And Mike Tomlin is gonna waste no time. He brings out Boswell, as this is to win the game. Kick is up down the middle it is good Steelers are gonna win in overtime as they beat the Chargers what a crazy game in Pittsburgh I mean this was a battle as the Chargers are going home and the Steelers win this game but how about that that was our first overtime game on the Madden 24 simulations as we're now gonna go to Denver Mile High City and the Broncos are gonna knock off Anthony Richardson in the Colts 35 to 24 so Russell Wilson in this Broncos squad is now on the Sweet 16 with their new coach and now we're gonna go to Miami where the Dolphins a blowout against the Titans not even close as Tua leads the way for Miami in this 42-3 victory he had one touchdown and 216 yards on the night and now we are moving to Baltimore it is the Jets up by six against the Ravens but Lamar Jackson has it 35 as 48 seconds remain Jackson goes to his man and oh my goodness he just go laid out 
What a hit! It's incomplete, and they're talking trash to each other on the field. What a game this is in Baltimore, and now it's a fourth down. Jackson, to keep the game alive, finds Bateman, and they convert to keep the drive alive. 6-12, to if they get a touchdown and the extra point, the Ravens will win this one and move on as 41 seconds. Here comes Jackson, and he's going to go down. Sacked by the Jets. Big time defensive play. Timeout Baltimore. They have to burn one. So they only have one more remaining. 38 seconds from their own 22. Second and 16. Jackson needs to make a play happen. Breaks a tackle. Here's Jackson. Oh, gets down to the 44. Big time play for Lamar. And the Ravens are on the move. And Baltimore won't burn a timeout. Or now they do with 10 seconds. So they have one remaining. Jackson throws it out of bounds. Eight seconds, still one timeout, but they need to get in the end zone. Need to get a miracle. Down to three seconds in this game. It's a third and ten. Jackson, this is on the line. The game's on the line, and he's going to run it. What is he doing? Come on, Madden. And it's over. The Jets will knock off the Ravens 12-6, to a low-scoring game. But ultimately, New York and Aaron Rodgers beats the Ravens to move on. But now continuing off this round of 30, we go to Houston where the Buffalo Bills with Josh Allen will knock off the Texans 28 to 14. And the Bills, no surprises here, no upsets here. They will knock off the Texans as they're eliminated in this simulation. And now we are going to Seattle where the Seahawks are gonna hold on as time is gonna run out for the Vikings. Down by six, it is over. The upset is complete. Seattle beats the Vikings in the first round. Who expected this? So down goes the Vikings and on goes the Seahawks. As now we go to Arizona, it is the Panthers 23 to 17 over the Arizona Cardinals. So the rookie quarterback gets it done for Carolina and for Kyler Murray and the Cardinals, a first round elimination. And the Panthers will be moving on. And I know there's a lot of Chicago Bears fans out there, so shout out to you guys. But you are going to go home in a blowout to the LA Rams as Matt Stafford and Cooper Cup get the job done. So Chicago will be going down 31 to six. Well now guys, we are going to Green Bay and the Eagles are on the verge of losing this game as they need to go on a game winning drive. And there's Devontae Smith just got laid out. 43 seconds, can the Packers upset the Eagles? We already seen the Bengals get upset by the Patriots as Jalen Hurts uses his legs and gets the first down for the Eagles, but they have to burn a timeout, only one remaining at the 47 yard line. Need a touchdown to take the lead. I know you Eagles fans are a little bit scared right now. Here's Hurts in shock formation. Hurts bouncing out, throws across his body. Oh my goodness, it's caught by Quez Watkins. That may be the greatest pass I've ever seen. How did he get that in there? Off one leg, going the other way. Jalen Hurts is ridiculous. Oh my goodness, and the Eagles will score here. Green Bay silencing the crowd, but Green Bay still has four seconds remaining. They don't need a field goal at this point. They're not in range, and they're going to get sacked, and that's going to do it. Hassan Reddick gets the job done, and the Eagles will avoid the upset as they defeat the Packers 27-24, and they're on their way to the Sweet 16. As our last matchup of the first round will come in Atlanta as the Falcons will take out the 49ers 21 to three points unless there's a Hail Mary. No, and the Falcons, how about that? On their way to the Sweet 16 as they will go against the Saints in the second round as the 49ers, their season will come to an end. Well guys, the first round is over here on this Madden 24 simulation. As you see the teams in the Sweet 16, what a crazy first round. A couple upsets nonetheless, but absolute madness as they're the teams remaining. Hopefully your final four is still intact. But anyways, I hope you're enjoying this simulation up to this point as it is now time to find out which teams are going to the Elite Eight as we simulate the Sweet 16 here in Madden. Let's go. Well, the Sweet 16 will begin in New Orleans with the Saints are on their way to the final eight teams remaining as they will defeat the Falcons 21 to 27. And how about the Saints with Derek Carr? So far in this tournament, two wins, and they keep their tournament hopes alive. As for the Falcons, they will be going out in the second round. But anyways, fellas, we are now on to Kansas City. The Dolphins have it at the 47. Need a touchdown to win the game. And here they come. Second and one. 40 seconds for Tua. And this is a tough second round matchup for Kansas 
Kansas City. The Dolphins have so much firepower on offense, but the Chiefs defense needs to stop as here is Tua goes right side to Jalen Waddle. But I mean, you're gonna need more yards than that to get in the end zone as the clock is ticking in the fourth quarter, 30 seconds. One time up for Miami, they don't use it. So here we go, clock going under 15 seconds. Tua needs to go deep, but he gives it up short. Not sure if that's the play you wanna get right there. In 10 seconds, Dolphins used their last timeout. It is gonna come down to this. They need to go to the end zone, can't afford anything inbounds. 10 seconds, 34 yard line, Tua steps up, Tua for the end zone. Completely overthrows that one. So now that's gonna bring up one play remaining in this game. Kansas City defense looking for a stop. Miami looking for a miracle. We saw the Patriots do it in the first round. Tua for the end zone. Ball in the air, deflected. Great defensive play. And the Chiefs will hold on and knock off the Dolphins. 28-23 in a wild finish. Miami just couldn't get it done as their tournament hopes will end in the second round, losing by five. And now we're gonna be on to New York. It is the Jets taking out the Jaguars 21 to 13. So Aaron Rodgers gets the W here. And that sets up a matchup in the Elite Eight against the Kansas City Chiefs. But down goes Trevor Lawrence and the Jacksonville Jaguars losing this game and going home. And now we are off to Denver, or Buffalo, I should say, where the Bills will knock off the Broncos 28 to 13. Josh Allen only had 169 yards, but that's all they needed to take out the Broncos and send them packing. And we're now gonna go to a game in New England. It is my Steelers over the Patriots in a blowout. So the Pittsburgh Steelers are on their way to the Elite Eight as they defeat the Patriots. The Patriots low-key shouldn't be here right now. They had that crazy game in week one, but anyways, they fall and they're gonna be going home. And how about the Seattle Seahawks in this one as they knock off the Panthers going to the Elite Eight, winning 13 to 10, a low scoring game, but Seattle knocked off Minnesota in an upset and then they beat the Panthers. So they are on their way to the Elite Eight and for the Panthers, their tournament is over. And now we see the Cowboys and the Eagles battling it out. Third and in trips for the Cowboys. Their season is on the line in Philadelphia. They're at midfield, need a touchdown to tie and an extra point to take the lead. Here's Dak Prescott, Prescott. What was that? What was that, Madden? Are you kidding me? He just screwed off his best receiver's helmet. And the game's gonna come down to this from Dallas. Need a first down, and they got it. Keep the drive alive, but they have to burn their last time out at midfield. The Cowboys, here we go. First and 10, 11 seconds. Dak rolling right, and he's gonna throw it out of bounds. Second down, and so maybe two plays remaining for Dallas as they still need to get in the end zone. Eagles defense, their fans are on their feet. Prescott, another pass out of bounds. He is not doing well in the fourth quarter of this game. And here comes the last play of the game. It's gonna come down to this. Prescott looking for some magic. Throws to the end zone, there's a flag. There's a flag before it even gets in. What is the call? They're gonna call a defensive pass interference. Oh my goodness, that's gonna give the Cowboys the ball at the one. The refs are giving the Cowboys an opportunity. I mean, are you serious right now? Dak Prescott only needs his one yard for the win, and he missed this. It's an incompletion. Eagles hold on despite the Cowboys getting a play at the end of the game for free. Oh man, I don't even have words for that guys. Madden almost just cost the Eagles the game as they hold on to win. So eight teams remain as we have the Jets, Chiefs, Steelers, Bills, Saints, Eagles, Giants, and Seahawks. Is your Final Four team still intact? I mean, if you have all Final Four of your team still in it, that is crazy. But anyways, guys, it is now time to simulate here in Madden to see which teams will make the Final Four. I mean, what a tournament it's been up to this point. It's been a lot of fun. So without further ado, guys, this Madden 24 Ultimate Tournament will continue on in the Elite Eight. So let's keep it rolling. Here we go. Starting off the Elite Eight, we're gonna see the Seahawks take out the Giants 24 to 10. Who predicted this? The Seahawks are the first team in the Final Four. I did not see this coming, but they knock off the Giants and then they move on. I mean, some may say they had a cupcake run, but still, nonetheless, they're in the Final Four. And now we're gonna go to Kansas City. Aaron Rodgers has it down by two, 40 seconds at his own 25. Needs a field goal for the win. Rodgers has been here before. Finds his running back, doesn't get out of bounds. So the Jets have to burn 
we're in a timeout, only two remaining. The winner of this game moves on to the final four in the AFC as here's Aaron Rodgers. Play action, Rodgers got his tight end. That is Conklin, does he get out of bounds though so they have to burn another timeout as here's the field goal kicker. Need to get him in range to win this game. The Chiefs defense, they play well in this tournament. Can they get another defense to stop as Rodgers scrambling off one leg, go for the end zone. Oh, what a defensive play. That could have been a touchdown, but 35 stepped in and got a great deflection. As now just 23 seconds remain, second and 10. Rodgers, midfield incomplete. So that's gonna bring up a third down. This Chiefs defense, man, they are playing so good. A shotgun, five wide for Aaron Rodgers. Rodgers, and, and they're talking trash to each other on the field. On the what line. a game this is in Baltimore. Down. Can Aaron Rodgers step up for the Jets? Here we go. It is loud right now in Kansas City. Rodgers making some play calls. Snaps it. Rodgers needs a first down. He got it. A big play to Corey Davis. Timeout Jets, and that puts him in field goal range. Aaron Rodgers steps up in the biggest moments. And so the Jets bring out their field goal kick. Looking for the win. This to give New York the lead and to send the final four. Kick is up and it's good. Jets will strike. Unbelievable drive from Aaron Rodgers. Only a couple seconds left, but that's going to mean Patrick Mahomes is going to have to have a miracle. So one play remaining for Kansas City. We've seen miracles already happen in this simulation. Mahomes across his body and intercepted. So that's going to be all she wrote. The Jets will get it done and defeat the Chiefs. I feel like a lot of you guys had Kansas City in the Final Four, but in today's simulation, they will go out in the Elite Eight to the New York Jets with Aaron Rodgers. And the Philadelphia Eagles are on their way to the Final Four as they knock off the Saints 27-24. It was a close game. And give credit to New Orleans for making it this far. They almost actually beat the Eagles as well. But for Derek Carr and New Orleans, their tournament host will come to an end as the Eagles advance on. And now it's the Pittsburgh Steelers on the Final Four as they beat the Bills, holding Josh Allen and Buffalo to only seven points. So the Bills and the Chiefs, as well as the Bengals, not even in the Final Four as the Steelers get the upset and they advance on in this tournament. The Final Four is here. If you got more than three right, definitely congratulate yourselves and let me know down below as we have the New York Jets, Pittsburgh Steelers, Philadelphia Eagles and Seattle Seahawks. I'm actually surprised both these teams have made this far. But anyways, guys, this has been madness up to this point. The final four teams are here from the AFC and the NFC. And now it's time to find out which teams will make this Super Bowl in this one huge NFL tournament on Madden 24. So sit down, sit back, relax, and let's sum up the final four here in Madden. Let's go. A battle of the birds. The Seahawks down by four points, a minute and 40 to go. Winner moves on in the big game. Here's Geno Smith looking to go on a gambling drive as he finds Metcalf no one near him. DK Metcalf turns on the burners. The Eagles can't catch him, and he's in. One play, Seahawks score. This place is going absolutely crazy. Are you kidding me, Geno Smith? Push the Seahawks in front of this game. And now with the Eagles down by three points, they have a minute and 30 seconds remaining in this game. As here's a kickoff in Seattle. Eagles are returning. Here comes a returner, breaks free to the 40, 50. What a return. He gets out of bounds at the 45 yard line of Seattle. And that puts the Eagles in good formation as they're now in third and two. Quick pass, gets the first down for Jalen Hurts. So the Eagles are on the drive, and the Eagles are already in field goal range. So right now they're threatening for a touchdown. As here's the handoff, Penny got some space to juke, and he gets the first down. And the Eagles, I mean, right now they can score. I can't believe this game. It is absolutely crazy. Seahawks, Eagles going at it. First and 10 for Hurts, only one timeout. Steps up, takes it, and he slides down. So he gets the nine yard line, and the Eagles aren't gonna burn their last time. I'm out. I think they may just settle for the field goal. I don't know what they're going to do, but 13 seconds, they finally call it. Still down by three. 
And so Philly is just going to go for the tie. I'm not sure. They could have went to the end zone here, but let's see what happens. They go for the field goal, and they tie it up. I know you Eagles fans wanted a touchdown. I'm not sure why they didn't go for it. But anyways, nonetheless, they tie up the game here. A big-time conversion for Philly. So only eight seconds remain in this game. They're going to hand it off. The Seahawks might just go to the overtime, but... They're going to get a nice run here first down. That sets up maybe a Hail Mary for Geno Smith in Seattle. As one last play for the Seahawks, or we're going to go to overtime. Here's Geno Smith in the pocket. Time's going to expire. Creating some moves. Look at Smith. Going to go deep. What a pass. The ball's downfield. And there's a flag on the play. No way this is a defensive pass interference. And it is. Are you kidding me? The Eagles have had two defensive pass interference as time expires. So the Seahawks have a chance to win the game now. I mean, you cannot make this up. And now the Seahawks bring out the kicker. And this, the Sensei out of the Super Bowl. Here we go. Snap, kick, good. Seahawks win at the buzzer. Eagles fans, I mean, this has to be the worst stretch of games ever. First it happened against the Cowboys, and now against the Seahawks. I mean, this should be overtime, but Seattle's gonna get a gift from the referees, and they're gonna go to the Super Bowl. How about that? And to meet Seattle in the Super Bowl, it is gonna be the New York Jets, as they will take on the Steelers 27 to 23. But what a run it was for Pittsburgh, making it all the way to the Final Four. However, Aaron Rodgers gets it done, and the Jets are on their way to the a big game. Who predicted this Super Bowl matchup as we have the Seattle Seahawks with Geno Smith against Aaron Rodgers and the New York Jets? I mean, how crazy is this? If anybody actually predicted this one, guys, let me know down below because you are GOATs. I mean, what a crazy matchup this is in the Super Bowl. But both these teams have fought hard to get all the way to the championship game. And now it's going to come down to one game to determine the winner of today's simulation and the NFL Super Bowl. Well, guys, sit down, sit back, relax. It's been a fun tournament up to this point, And now it's time for the finale. So here we go. Seahawks, Jets, Super Bowl. Seahawks, Jets. Going down to the wire in the Super Bowl. Here's a second and five for Rodgers at his seven yard line, and he can't get in just yet. 31, threatening to score and take the lead. 50 seconds, and the clock is ticking. Can the Seahawks get a stop? Rodgers incomplete so the super bowl is gonna come down to this and seattle will win the game with a stop meanwhile the jets need to convert here on fourth and one it's gonna come down to this rogers what's he gonna do they're gonna head it off to Brees hall and he's in up the middle that was too easy and the jets go in front in the super bowl and the new york jets fans at home starting to feel this one as they're up by one point but they're gonna go for the two point conversion and make it a three point game rogers looking rogers doesn't even go to the end zone it's not going to be complete and that's a big play because the Seahawks all they need to do to win the game is to get in a field goal range so here comes Geno Smith in Seattle down by one point 26 seconds first and 10 from their own 27 Smith gonna go right side got a man and here come the Seahawks all of a sudden as they need to get the kicker to the 41 yard line to win this game as the Jets defense needs a big time stop first and 10 22 seconds all three timeouts Smith Finds Metcalf, beats his man. Sauce Gardner can't catch up, and he's going to be in the end zone. Seahawks have just taken the lead. I can't believe it. Jano Smith to DK Metcalf again. Oh, my goodness. One of the most clutch plays in Super Bowl history. And DK Metcalf in this simulation has had so many big plays as he burns one of the best corners in the game, Sauce Gardner. And the Seahawks in the Super Bowl have the lead. And they are going crazy right now in Seattle. And for the Jets, they are left speechless. Sauce Gardner can't even believe it either. But New York sauce Aaron Rodgers down by seven, six seconds. Maybe he can get two plays. Rodgers going to scramble. Rogers gonna go right. Rogers looking has all day. Heaves it downfield and it is caught as time expires. But I think there's a flag on Aaron Rodgers, so it doesn't really matter. It's gonna be on Green Bay. Yes, it is. So the Seahawks are gonna win the simulation. Unbelievable. They do it. They beat the Jets and they are the champions of this 32 team NFL tournament. Wow, unbelievable. Did anybody predict Geno Smith and the Seattle? Seahawks to win it all because in today's 
today's NFL simulation. They have done it as they are the first team to win here in the Madden 24 simulations. But guys, this was absolutely so much fun. So crazy. So many awesome moments. I hope you all enjoyed it. And if you watched every single moment, comment down below. Go. I'll be reading all your comments. You guys are seriously all the goats as the celebration continues for Seattle. But it is Southdown Reductions. I'll see you in the next Madden video. And we out for today. Wow.